Hi everyone. Today we're going to make chicken balatong. You'll need 14 ounces or 400 grams of green mung beans. This can be found at Asian or Filipino food stores. Here I've placed about an inch of water above the beans, but really you should put at least two inches, as you'll see later. I'll be using one medium onion, chopped, one and a half tablespoons of ginger, minced, and five cloves of garlic, minced. About three pounds of chicken, washed. I have a six quart pot with two tablespoons of vegetable oil. The mung beans seem to be doing pretty good. I'll stir them occasionally. Make sure I have enough water. Okay, here I am sauteing the onion, garlic, and ginger. Then we'll add the chicken. When I add enough water, we let it cover at the top. That's about four cups. All right, here's one more cup. And then I want to submerge the chicken and bring it to a boil. And then I'm going to simmer it for 40 minutes. Okay, so I'll add some pepper. And then I'll add some garlic powder. Great, I just broke something. Okay, broken thing all cleaned up. Alright, so I'm adding some garlic pepper. I mean garlic powder. And then let's check on the mung beans. I don't know if I put enough water, but this thing has about 10 more minutes ago, and it looks like they're getting uh, thick. And there's some water there, but I hope it doesn't run out and cause it to burn. So we don't want burned mung beans. So I'm going to add some water, so I don't want to chance it. I'm going to cover these mung beans, because I don't want it to lose any more water. I'd rather drain water than have it be too dry. So I have a whole bunch of spinach that I'm going to add near the end. I cut most of the rough stems off, but not all of them. It's okay. Okay, the mung beans are about done. When you weren't looking, I actually added more water because I was worried about them. So I'm going to drain these. Okay, so it's boiling. I'm going to bring it down to medium low. And cover it. Okay, so I've added the mung beans after simmering the chicken for 40 minutes. And now I'm going to let it simmer for another 5 minutes. I'm going to add some fish sauce. About a tablespoon. That should be good. So I'm going to cover it and simmer it for 5 minutes. So I made some steamed rice while we were waiting, and I've added this spinach bunch, and I'm going to turn this off pretty soon. There's a lot of liquid in here. It'll thicken up, because of the mung beans, they can, it continues to absorb. Alright, there you have it. We have chicken balatong and spinach with rice.